That's not how I eat a twister. I'm just very single. It's advertising. Thank you. Hi, it's me, popular Lorraine Kelly impersonator, Tia Coffee, and this is what's in my school bag. Let's see what's in the school bag. A hoodie. This is a lovely Pussycat Dolls hoodie, and it's always exactly the one that I used to wear when I did pee at school because I didn't subscribe to the norms of uh, what aesthetic you're supposed to wear for sports ball or whatever we were being forced to do against our will. The reason why I've got this hoodie is because I went to a Pussycat Dolls concert with my friends when I was about 15. And I looked at their merch stall and I saw this gorgeous hoodie that said, loosen up my buttons on the hood. And I just found it really funny because it had a zip. That's not a button in sight. So after spending 50 pounds just for the joke, which in retrospect, I regret, I hate PE. Actually swimming specifically, I can't swim. I never learn. Do you remember that thing we had to turn up to swimming one time in pajamas and then like jump in the water and get a brick? I was like, I'm never gonna do this in my real life. I'm not gonna approach the sea. I'm not gonna be near any large bodies of water out of choice. And if I am, I won't be in pajamas and I'm not fetching a brick. What was I like at school? Great question. I think I was quite uh, a bit of a nerd. I think I worked reasonably hard, but at all the things you weren't supposed to. I never really did my homework until the last minute because, you know, she knew she was going to pull it off anyway. So I put the effort in. But I put all my hard work into, like, doing all the extracurricular activities. So I was in, like, every play, every choir. I did RAF cadets. And here I am now. <laughs> After all that training, this is where your Duke of Edinburgh Gold Award goes. <laughs> Oh, gorgeous. This is a prefect badge. If I haven't covered it enough with my absolute nerdy behavior, um, I was actually a prefect at school. I quite enjoyed it. So real talk, I was actually deputy head of house. We had like a house system, like in Harry Potter. Um, and I was deputy head of house and the person who was head of house had no business being. So if you're watching Natalie, I'm still bitter. Yeah, I took it very seriously. I once gave someone a detention because I had that power, which I said was for not having his top button done up, but it was actually because he was selling cigarettes to like 10 year olds. And I didn't want to get him in too much trouble. So I just said it was a top button situation, but you know, that was me being a nice person. <laughs> oh my goodness. Where did you find a retro discman? For the children, this is a discman. It played a limited number of songs. So I'm a massive fan of Blazing Squad, or at least I was at the time when I was at school listening to my discman with a Blazing Squad CD on. Why were Blazing Squad so iconic? Well, they had so many members and they were from my local area. Do you know what I mean? Down the road in Chingford. They also had a song called Crossroads, which had some iconic moves. Here's the choreography. You can learn it at home. I feel like we should, can we get like a group of us together to do the choreography? But they had like a couple of iconic songs. Flip Reverse, which at the time I was like, oh, what a fun song about uh, music or something. Turns out, anal. I, d I didn't know the straight community was so into anal, but you live and you learn at the age of 14. What is it? Can I look inside? Let's have a little... Oh, it's a scotch egg and a penguin. Delicious. I actually love a scotch egg. I actually have a mild intolerance to egg, but it's too yummy. At break times, I used to get bought things by the girls in the older years. So I always used to get bought a twister. But the weird thing is that the girl who used to buy me twisters later became just right from the only way is Essex. Do you even want the last bit? How do you eat a penguin? Well, you bite into it and then you eat it. No, you're right. I say you bite both ends off, get your teeth around it, separate it into two chunks, enjoy the central cream chocolate section and then enjoy the rest as two wafers. Thank you, Just Right, from Towie. That's not how I eat a twister. I'm just very single. It's advertising. Thank you. And that's what was in my school bag. Good catch.